If you're constantly recreating your color grades from scratch, stop. Here's a way you can save your look as a preset and apply it to any clip that you want in your project or in any other project with just one click. Hey, I'm Jason and I make videos here on YouTube helping you learn how to edit faster in DaVinci Resolve, how to make those videos sound amazing because I'm an audio guy, and how to save time while you're doing it all. So let's go jump into this tip. In DaVinci Resolve here, we're in the color tab. And let's say you've gone ahead, you created a color grade for your clip. If I turn this off, you can see there's the before, there's the after. I wanna save this so I can apply it to all of my other clips. All I'm gonna do is make sure I've got my gallery open here. I'm selected on stills. And then I'm gonna right click on my image anywhere and say grab still. That's gonna put it right over here. Now I can go to a new clip and all I have to do is drag and drop this onto the clip and it's gonna apply that exact same color grade. As a bonus tip, if you wanna access this in any project that you might have, you're gonna to wanna to put that still in a power grade. And you can do that a few ways. You can create it here in this still gallery and then drag and drop it into the power grades. And then there it is. Or you could just select power grades to begin with, right click and say grab still and it's gonna put that in your power grades for you. So power grades are accessible in any project that you'll be in. You can grab it, apply it, and then be off and running and continuing to work on your project. Now, quick extra tip, if you don't see your power grades or your stills, make sure you've got this little icon clicked on so you can see your different stills and power grades here, as well as the gallery button right up here. So now your look is saved as a preset, you're good to go. You can work through your color grades a whole lot faster and save yourself time when you're editing your project. If you want more fast DaVinci Resolve tips like this one, because I've got tons of them, there's so many tips that I could give you, hit that subscribe button and make sure that you don't miss the next one. With that said, thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Jason, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.